Hi guys, welcome to Neon Vision, and in today's video I'm gonna be reacting to the entry of Estonia, which is Bridges by Alika. Estonia last year got a very good place with the song Hope, which is a song that I've always liked at the first listen. I loved his voice. Uh, that song was something unique we have never really heard on Eurovision and normally I'm not that into those kind of songs but I don't know why but that song has always felt very special for me and I've always liked it I even had it in my top 10 you can watch it in my one of my YouTube shorts talking about YouTube shorts this year I'm also gonna post a top 10 uh, in a format of shorts because Last year it got pretty viral, so I think it's a very good decision to do the same this year. I mean, I got a lot of dislikes and not really positive comments because of my list itself, because it was not really a usual top list, because I just felt like that. People had a very different opinion than me, but for me that's not a problem at all, because everyone has their own taste, and that was my taste. Uh, if someone didn't like it, then... I don't really care to be honest and I don't even have a problem with the dislikes because I don't care about them either but I hope you're looking forward to my top 10 list but today let's react to Estonia all right let's hear Bridges from Alika it's gonna be the national final performance and it's a piano that plays itself interesting start <laughs> I don't know if it's, if it's a reaction that everyone else has felt, but so far it feels like one specific song, which is Skyfall from Adele. I don't know why, but I hope you get it why. I love the piano. Such a calming voice. There is always time to get back on track, tearing down the wall slowly every step. Now I see my smile building up a world of bridges. This is amazing. There is one more thing you need to know that I forgive myself for all the lies. This is amazing. No more time to waste out of every time. This melody is, is very captivating. It will never go out of my head. I just know. I just know because it's so easy to remember. And it's really good. I love her voice, it's so powerful. She looks very young, definitely. There is always time to get back on track, tearing down the wall slowly every step. This is the best part of the song. Every time she sings this part, I love that. Huge moment at the end. That's what we need. Incredible. That's the end. It was three minutes long. I have no idea why, but I just felt like it was way, way, way shorter. It's probably because I enjoyed it so much that I couldn't pay attention to the length at all. And I didn't expect it to end. 
Uh, but I'm actually sad, about, sad that it ends. I would definitely be able to listen to it for a few more minutes. That's why I'm gonna listen to it once more and then I will share my opinion with you. So Estonia went in a very different direction from last year and I think it worked out very very well. The thing I've noticed this year is that so far out of the songs I reacted to I don't think I have even heard a, like a traditional ballad. As far as I know this is the first one uh, that I'm reacting to and it might even be the best one obviously I don't know if, if there are any other ballads or and if there are, are they better or are they worse? But this has the potential to be the best ballad this year. The epicness of this melody in the chorus, I love that a lot. It's just, you just can't get bored of it. It's a thing that I enjoy listening to a lot. I love the use of piano, I like the lyrics, I like the staging as well. I mean, they don't have to complicate it in any way. They just need some graphics at the background, the piano, uh, the guy who played the violin, was it a violin? I, that might not be a violin, I don't know. So yeah, they don't have to complicate the staging at all, but I think they're gonna do a very good job with the staging and the performance as well, because I can see that she's an amazing singer, she doesn't make any mistakes, and she can sing this song perfectly. And I think nothing else is needed for Estonia to qualify, so I definitely think they will do it, or at least I hope so, because they would deserve it a lot. So yeah, last year Eurovision was packed with ballads and a lot of them weren't really good in my opinion. I, I liked a lot of them, but also a lot of them weren't really good. This year, this is almost the first I've heard, but this is, this is amazing. Like, this is better than a lot of uh, ballads from last year. So the last thing I'm gonna do today is give this song an 8 points out of 10. I think this song is an amazing song and... Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be a winner, but a top 15 finish would be kind of interesting, or at least top 20, but I, I really hope they qualify because they deserve to do it. So last but not least, what do you think about this song? Let me know in the comments, and if you enjoyed this video, then give it a like and a subscribe. You can also follow me on Instagram and TikTok as well, and see you in the next video. Goodbye.